Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Unlock, Unlock Your Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICSE Mathematics Chapter 24, Area and Perimeter Exercise 24, B Question 10. And this is a book contains 360 pages which measure 20 cm by 14 cm. Every page has a blank margin 2.5 cm deep along each short side and 2 cm deep along each long side. Find the total area available for printing, right? Now, what does this uh, tell you, right? See here that a book contains 360 pages. So, in a book there are 360 pages, but um, for your convenience, I'll just draw here one page out of those 360, right? Now, what you can see here, in this page, there is some margin left. What is margin? Suppose we have seen in our textbooks some space is left, right, uh, uh, for the text to be printed. The text is not directly printed from the corners, right. Same happens over here. What is done is that some space is left on top, bottom, left and right, okay, um, sorry, right, left and right. So you see here that just for your convenience, I'll draw the margins here, fine, right, suppose. Although margins are not drawn, but I'll, I'm just drawing it to show you. So basically the blank space is the margin and this line, inside this line the text will be printed. Fine. Now what it says is that uh, the length, let's see the length, this is going to be 14, right, um, 14 centimeters and uh, this is going to be 20 centimeters because it is given in the question 20 centimeter by 14, fine. Now see here what is said, next is that for, uh, there is a margin 2.5 centimeter deep along each short side okay and 2 centimeter deep along each long side fine that means what this is the long side and this is the short side so there is a uh, what there is gap of how many centimeters here and here between the short side there is a gap of 2.5 centimeters fine 2.5 and 2.5 centimeters here. What next is see here this one and this one. Here we have a margin of 2 centimeters only, right? This is what it's being said in the question. There is 2.5 centimeter deep along each short side. This is short side and there is a margin of 2.5 centimeters deep along it. This is the long side and there is a margin of 2 centimeters deep along it, right? So see here, now calculate the new uh, breadth, right? The length we know is what? 20 centimeters. And what else do we know here? The breadth, uh, length is 20, but we have to subtract 2, 2 centimeters from the length, right? This is 20 and 2, 2 centimeters, both of the places it will be left out. So 20 minus 4. 16 centimeters fine and then the new breath becomes what breath here is what 14 here it's 2.5 and 2.5 so 14 minus uh, i'm sorry 2.5 simply we can write 2.5 and 2.5 as 5 as well so 14 minus 5 becomes 9 centimeters right now see here that calculate the new area new area available for printing right will be what see here length into breadth that will be what 9 into 16 right and um, what does 9 into 16 give you uh, 144 right 144 square centimeters but this is not over yet because this is the area only for one page but in the entire book there are how many pages 360 pages so our total area will consist of what entire thing right entire 360 pages so 144 into 360 okay so what will this give us let's see 144 into 360 this will be 5180 square Say it four zero square centimeters, right? This becomes our total area. All right, and friends, this is all for today. If you are new to my YouTube channel, do not forget to subscribe and leave a like on this one. Till then, take good care of yourselves and bye bye.